Well, where has the week gone? I cannot believe we are already at Thursday. Man, that week has just flown right by. So as you can see on the screen is the wonderful pictures that we have taken last Friday. The theme is be kind. We all have this amazing power and gift to do things to help change people's days. So even if you don't think it's a safe place to speak up, there are many other ways that you can leave an impact on someone that is being bullied. You can talk to them. A simple little, hello, how are you doing? Can change someone's day to a bad day to a good day. You can sit with them at recess. You can play with them at recess. You can say hello at lunch or on the bus. Kids who are bullied often feel like no one cares for them or they feel like they are less. If you haven't gotten the feeling of this week, you matter. I cannot stress that enough. You matter so much to me and everyone else in the school. So when you feel down on your lowest day, remember, you matter. You can make a difference because you matter. Being kind can let them know that they are not alone. Don't bully others and don't join in and watch the bullying happen. Speak up if it feels safe or if not, report the bullying to a trusted adult. And all it takes is one person to stand up and to be kind to the person that is being bullied. We all have a job here and it's to lift others up as they are going through a rough day. The more that we can lift each other up, the better that we come together as a community and family. If you ever receive a harmful message through an email or a text, you have two choices. You can either send it to a trusted adult so that we can put a stop to it, or you can text back and say, this is mean, that's bullying, and I am not going to forward this. Be very straightforward when you do reply, if you feel that it's safe. Remember, always report cyberbullying as well. We have staff members here ready to help at all times. If you follow this week's tips and keep yourself safe on the internet and be friendly, life will be just great. Always be respectful and report bullying to an adult, whether if you see it online or in person. If you see cyberbullying, save the evidence, don't join in, and do not forward the mean message to everyone else. Remember, respect is earned. It's not just a given item. We, both as boys and girls, have such an amazing talent in life. We have the ability to give back and to help others. Do not ever say anything that someone can't do something because they are a boy or a girl. You know what? As someone used to once told me, if it's to be, it is up to me. Anything is possible as long as you believe and trust in yourself because you matter. Don't use mean names because you think that they are not acting like other boys and girls. Follow this week's tips on how to treat others with kindness. Always be kind and make others feel very welcomed. Sometimes what a person just needs is a hello and good morning, and that can set someone's day off to a great start. This here helps us make our school a much safer and friendlier place. Remember that everyone has something that they can do to help another because you matter. Now, friends, with this amazing week, I am so excited to see all this wonderful coming together and us coming together as a family in a community. Keep up the great work because we are Southeast. I hope you guys had a blast this week. Tomorrow, I have created a film for y'all to wrap up the week on a positive note. Um, for my younger kiddos, we are doing a giving tree. K through six, the youngers will, excuse me, be reading the giving tree. Um, my older uh, classes, feel free to rewatch it. I will send the link out. It is just a great, motivating, powerful story. So on the leaves that will be in your mailboxes, um, teachers, have your student write a positive note on there. My K-1 students can just color on the leaves and that will be fine. All you have to do is just cut them out, write your positive note, add some color on it, and call it fine and dandy and put them back in my mailbox. We are going to be displaying this 
giving tree out in the open for everyone to see so that if you're ever having that bad day, come by the giving tree, pull off a leaf as a little positive note for the day, and your day should be right on fine. So Southeast of Selene Elementary students, I am so proud to see all the wonderful things you guys have done this week. Keep up the great work. Remember, be awesome today, and we love you all. So have a great Thursday, and I can't wait to see how bright we are today. Bye.